Hey everyone. So today hey it is a beautiful 72 yeah, degrees. It's gorgeous. sunny. And uh, finally, we, yeah, finally, it's not right. snowing. That's good. Yeah, maybe that's tomorrow. It's gonna snow. I yeah, think. probably. But anyways, um, so we had a pretty cool plan today. Not something we usually do. It's not one of our typical explores, but it was something that we saw that inspired us. Yeah. We have a friend. His name's Trevor. Hey, Trevor. Hi, Trevor. Hi, Grace. And um, Trevor is a very, very, very good person and urban explorer. Yep. But he also does something else. This young man, and this is, when I say young man, he's right, <laughs> 20s, <Young. laughs> like low 20s. We're no spring but anyways, chickens over here. Yeah, right. So I think he'll be granddad, but whatever. Whatever. Uh, anyways, <laughs> so what he does is he goes to old cemeteries, abandoned cemeteries, and he cleans them up, mm. like little small ones. He'll cut the grass. He he brushes the stones. It's just he amazing. fixes the stones. Spends the whole day there. So we were inspired by that. Yep. So a few months back, found this old cemetery at one of our favorite places, Camp LaGuardia. It was so hard to get to. You could get to them, but to try to get to the stones was impossible because there was so much pickets and ugh, just it was awful thorns yeah for people that don't know what pickets are yeah exactly <laughs> which you know what let's just show them yeah let's just show them let's what show that them is. It, you had a crazy time i wasn't there but he had a crazy time yeah so look, look you'll see what i mean, <laughs> what mean. i'm toby cat right there brother frank right there what's up everybody and Hello. explore with me marlo c right there yeah, we just saw that. <clears throat> so, we found a little cemetery here, down here. Holy shit, look at this. Wow. Look at the one back there. Too. Couple back there. Yeah. Look at this. Sorry, I'm sucking it up. I'm going in there. It doesn't have a date. It says memory of Mary Little, wife of General Seth Marvin. Yep. That one doesn't say anything. <clears throat> this one's guarded. I don't care. Ow, ow. This is... I can't really read it. See that little child's grave right there? There's another little child's grave over here. Oh. Look, there's another one back there. Yeah, there's one back there, yep. Yeah, be careful. Oh my God, that's awesome. Got a little one right there. Some more back there. Oh. <clears throat> wow. Look at that. Cool. That's a nice that's a nice find right there. Nice find. Yeah. Okay. 
so you can see what I mean. <laughs> I walked away that day with some cuts. Yeah, I and think some you blood. needed a nurse. I after. did. That's right. <laughs> so, anyways, so that was our mission today to come to here to Camp LaGuardia and the cemetery right here. We come to fix it up. <laughs> however, however, when we got here, let us show you. Yeah. Somebody beat us to the punch. Somebody did a really, really good job. I mean, you can see that you can actually get to the stones now. Mm. And I don't mean the rolling stones, so don't be wise. But look, they put a flag. Even they even name they even put a little name. Yeah. Right there, Marvin Helm Cemetery, and you made brought up a good point. Did such this a could good have been job. a Boy Scout project. You yeah. know, who knows? It really looks to me like a like a. Yeah. But it could or also, Girl Scout or Girl Scout project. It could be a Boy Scout or Girl Scout project, or it could have just been the, you know. The town or something, or. Or a cemetery preservation. Yeah. We'll have to find out. If we find out, we'll put it in the <clears throat> description. So. As you can see, it's very easy to get to the uh, the stones now. Yeah. But it's a very, very old, old, old cemetery. And how do we know it's old? Well, just right here is a good, good way to tell. This is a Revolutionary War soldier. Well, he's a little bit more than a soldier. He was. Yep. This is Seth Marvin. And he was general. He was a general. General Seth Marvin in the Revolutionary War. So That's amazing. Yeah, we'll put some of the information. It's hard to read his stone. We're going to try to clean it up a little bit. Yeah. I mean, there's not a lot here for us to do, but we bought we brought some flowers. You know, we'll plant a couple flowers, try to clean up a little bit and uh Yeah, what can you do? Yeah, they really did a good job. Yeah. So, yeah. let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, maybe here. Like right here? Yeah. How like, deep? um, like across. What? Yeah, like. move that, right? Yeah, maybe like a, maybe like that much. Okay. We'll fill in whatever you don't use. There's a lot of, uh, roots in there. The roots, right, are all stuck together. Hopefully, it won't harm them. Does that deep enough? I just didn't want to get fake flowers. Yeah. Because fake flowers are stupid. What other one did you want to do with the wife, too, right? Yeah. Okay. Because I can uh... I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me Meant to be in the great outdoor, forever free. All right, geez, you earned yourself a nice back rub tonight. I'll see if I can find somebody to do that for you. <laughs> hey, you know what though? I feel kind of like a slacker because Trevor, like, he weed went. Okay, first of all, Trevor is 21 years old or 22, <laughs> okay? Yeah. You can't compare it to someone who's know, what, 70, how old are you? 75. Yeah, exactly. -ish. <laughs> She's not. Yeah, but he's a rock star. But, anyway, so here's, uh, I mean, we didn't do a lot different. I mean, we just but cleared we, it out yeah, a we, little. And yeah, made it flowers. prettied up with some flowers. Yeah. The flowers you can are... see the general. That's General Seth, Seth Marvin. Seth Marvin. Yep. And it's very interesting what it says here, but we'll have to put that down 
it was a, it's in regards to him being a philanthropist later in his life. So it's pretty cool. He lived to be 70 years old, so he didn't die in the Revolutionary 70 War. 70 years, six months. Hey, don't take away six months from yeah, the guy. Yeah, right? This is uh, his wife, Mary Little. Polly. She liked to be called Polly. With respect, Polly. Some other family members. That's a son right yeah. there. Also Seth Marvin, right? Yep. But he was the War of 1812. And Harriet, and there's our buddy. Yep. Then you see a couple of hornets who... Oh, here he comes. Hey, back off. <laughs> Kick your ass. <laughs> but yeah, there's a couple of those hornets uh, trying to horn in on us. <laughs> but yeah, it's just... Uh, Hey, look at this dragonfly. Oh, wow. I think that's the spirit of one of these people telling us thank you. You think so? Yeah. That sounds good to me. But, uh, yeah. I mean, we helped it a little, but whoever came and did it, did a really nice job. Yeah. Did a really nice job. Got a little, little sign and a flag and... Very impressed. Roll them up. <laughs> okay. Yeah, some of this, this greenery around here is really pretty. You know, that we left, kind of left alone. Yeah. Until it starts to get over overgrown, you know. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be. 